Good evening, everyone. I'm glad to see you. I'm glad to see you seems to be such a simple phrase, but will we be still glad tomorrow if we suddenly lose our sight? The tricky thing about eye diseases is that you can actually feel them. It doesn't hurt you, it don't confuse you, but when it is, it's always already too late. And at this point, you'd better run for your life to your doctor to help you. Otherwise, and we don't want to treat patients when it's that bad. We want to prevent it. That's why ophthalmological doctors all around the world doing their best to reveal the problem before it hurts you that bad. The only way to achieve it is to do regular screening. And they do it for the risk groups of patients. But still, problem is too big. For example, the biggest risk group is the diabetic patients. If you don't screen your retina regularly, the risk of getting eye complications, which causes blindness, going up to 90%. That's not good. Only 15 years ago, only in Netherlands, there were 400,000 diabetic patients. Today, this number is tripled, and it's still growing by 1,200 weekly. But number of doctors, ophthalmological doctors who help them, are still the same. That's why we're in a deep D, truly believe that doctors could use some help. And we've built our artificial intelligence assistant that can help doctor to make a diagnosis just in a couple of seconds. By the way, these small circles you see on the screen, it's a eye retina pictures that we are using to diagnose diseases. Uh, here you can see around 1,000 of them. And to build and train our solution, we've collected previously 250,000. Uh, but at first, let me tell you how the screening process works today. First of all, you're going to your general practitioner, or a petition, or optometrist, making the picture, sending it to an ophthalmologist, and then he gives you diagnosis in a while. Due to Yama Research Group, average accuracy of human doctor is around 91%. At the same time, with the DBD solution, you still have to go to take your picture. But then you just jog and drop the photo, convolutional neural networks do all of the job, and you receive your diagnosis within one minute. And what's even better, accuracy is above 95%. We see our first customers as optician chains, general practitioners, and telemedicine companies, as they are the first line of eye care today. We're going to propose them our subscription model based on how much images they use monthly, starting with only five euros per image, comparing to the lowest price on Dutch market today is 25 euros per screening. Artificial intelligence in ophthalmology is a brand new field, and that's why we've got very few competitors in the world. There are three companies in the US, one in China, and we're the only one at that stage in Europe. And only one of these companies already received their FDA approval and CE mark to sell the product in the market. So all of the others are pretty at the same level of development. Still, the companies are different with the number of diseases they're working with and amount of hardware the solution could be implemented. And we see us quite in a good position comparing to them. But we've started our project only in September of the last year. We won soon several awards in Belarus, where we're originally from, with our first working prototype and been selected with this one to the Rockstar Digital Health Program in January. In April, we finalized our MVP for diabetic retinopathy, which, as you remember, is the biggest problem. And today, I'm extremely proud to announce you our new collaboration. Just yesterday, we've signed papers with iClinic Rotterdam, which is the biggest and best eye hospital in the Netherlands. During next 12 months, we're going to collect and annotate together with them more than 100,000 specialized images for glaucoma screening. 
and it will be the first glaucoma screening solution in the world. No one ever done this before. By the way, you can check today World's Ophthalmological Congress started in Barcelona and AI for glaucoma is the hottest topic there. If they can do something with AI for the glaucoma. But on top of it, Rotterdam Eye Hospital gonna invest in our common project 350,000 euros and validate our solution as the new standard in ophthalmology. Thank you. When the studies are done and papers are published, we're gonna penetrate Dutch market in the end of this year. And by 2020, we're gonna receive our FDI approval and move to US market. Behind the project is a small team of five, but which is a very strong collaboration of hardcore software engineers and best ophthalmological doctors, which give us great power. But today we've reached the point when we have to grow our team bigger. That's why we're looking for 550K of investment to finalize and bring our product to market and build our business development team. But still, our vision is bigger. Starting with the eye diseases, we are dealing with the human's retina, which is the one of the most informative part of a human body, because you can see blood vessels visually. And it gives us opportunity to discover cardiovascular diseases and neurological diseases also. So it's like a window into human's health. And this is still not the end. We expect just in several years that regular smartphone camera will become good enough to do your retinoscopy. And it will change all of the healthcare itself. And we're gonna be there when hardware is ready. Are you ready for this future? Then join us in our journey.